morning, Mavericks. Today is Tuesday, March 7th, and it is an A-Day. I am Connor. And I am Mackenzie, and these are today's announcements. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and a moment of silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Mavericks, we want to thank the PTA and volunteers that came out on Saturday to clean up our campus and make it look so beautiful. Let's make sure we are throwing away trash in trash cans and not on the ground. And we can all pick up trash if we see it. It's the Maverick way. There's a new challenge in Beanstack. If you like graphic novels, then this challenge is for you. There is a reading list to complete the challenge. Students must read at least 10, from, 10 books from the list. This challenge ends May 31st, so get reading. Also, Mavericks, check out the new bulletin board with the names of our Beanstack stars. These are the students that have been reading and logging their minutes. Is your name up there? The book fair is next week. Here is a video of some of the books that will be available at the book fair. My whole life, I've tried to stay under the radar. Invisible. But that doesn't always work. I used to be able to let things slide. But lately, I get angry. Really angry. And when I do... The worst part is... I don't think I can control it. A blaze. People call me a stray. The dog who lived at the mall with his BFF, the one and only Ivan, a mighty silverback. Now I have a new home, a new family, but there's someone I need to find. I'm Clarabel A. Ortega, and I'm the author of Witchlings and Frizzy. Witchlings is the story of 12-year-old Seven Salazar, who wants nothing more than to be in the powerful House Hyacinth Coven. Witchlings is a magical adventure, but it's also about the power of friendship, community, and believing in yourself. Frizzy is the story of a 12-year-old Dominican-American girl living in the Bronx named Marleni. Marleni is sick and tired of going to the salon every weekend to get her super curly hair straightened, so she goes on a journey to learn to love her curls. A lot of the experiences that she had growing up with really curly hair and uh, not wanting to disappoint her mom and living and growing up in the Bronx were all things that I experienced too. I hope anyone who reads Frizzy gets the message that there's more than one way to be beautiful and any way you choose to look or express yourself is okay. You can find my books, Witchlings and Frizzy, at the Scholastic Book Fair. Fragile is how people always describe me. I wish they'd see other things like my great taste in music or my heart shaped sunglasses. My bones break easily. I get why people focus on that, but I'm a thousand other things too. I'm whole constellations of wonders and weirdness and hope. An honest wish won't go unheard, not for one who seeks the hummingbird. We will share the schedule with you soon. Eighth graders that are going to the DC field trip, the next payment is due Friday. Are you into Minecraft? 
The first meeting is going, going to be Thursday, March 9th at 8 a.m. in the Media Center. Anyone that is interested can join. Remember to bring your Chromebook. Lastly, Mavericks, we want to remind you that tomorrow is an early release day. Remind your parents that school gets out at 1.15. That's it for the announcements. Stay tuned for the, birth for the birthdays and the lunch menu. Remember, here at Bradley, we are behaviorally aware, academically motivated, and safety-directed Mavericks. And it's a great day to be a Bradley Maverick. Kind. Um. <laughs> oh, I know this one. It means like to help people out and um, to be nice. Respectful, be nice, nice. helpful. Kindness. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Smiling. <laughs> yeah. Why is it important to be kind? Because if you're not nice to be, nobody's going to like you. Now, how kind is that? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday.